Hi guys, I'm Megan Graham and today I'm here to talk to you about something that people are always asking me. Oh, and before I start, this is my Yorkshire Terrier puppy, Alfie. I love him so much. So people are always asking me where I got my Yorkie puppies and I actually wanted to have a little conversation today about that. So the title of my video is Yorkie Puppy for Sale and I decided to do something a little bit different. I've got my computer right here, it's just out of frame and I wanted to actually talk to you about some of the things that you're going to see when you are looking for a Yorkie puppy. So first of all, if you type into Google, Safari, whatever browser you're using and you type in Yorkie puppy for sale, there is something that I want you to understand. Now, most people are not going to tell you this. And when I first was looking for a Yorkshire Terrier, I would not have known this myself. As I scan through all the results and I can't actually say the names of these websites, every single website that you see when you type in Yorkie puppy for sale, and it's a very popular thing to search online when you're looking for a Yorkie, I wouldn't buy a Yorkie puppy from anybody that's showing up on these pages. So basically all of these things, this one says pup lovers wanted, this one says sell your puppies online, search for your perfect pet. And I'm not gonna tell you the exact name of that website, but there's no such thing as a perfect pet. And I think it should really scare you just the fact that it says sell your puppies online. You don't want that. Another one has the word express in it. A lot of these are saying, so there's a finder website. Um, there's another one that has the word find in it. All of these websites are going to be from puppy mills. All of them are marketing. They're gonna talk about teacups. They're going to talk about minis and things like that. As I scan this website, I don't see a single reputable breeder on here. And I just wanted to talk about this because I know that when people start out and they're looking for their Yorkie puppy, they don't know exactly what the best way is to find one. Um, and I'm just telling you, if the website has the name puppy in it, don't buy a Yorkie from them and don't buy a puppy from them. A good breeder, and I don't think there are many of them, um, they're not going to be marketing to you. They don't need to market to you. They love their breed and they're actually going to be very discerning when they talk about selling you a puppy. They're really going to think about it as adopting. So I'm just scanning this a little bit. And so some of the things that come up are Yorkies for sale near me, Yorkie puppies for sale near me, Yorkshire Terrier puppies for sale. It's really in life you're going to get a better a better answer to your question when you ask the right question. I would actually search for Yorkies for adoption. I wouldn't only be looking for a puppy. You don't only need to get a puppy to have a fantastic Yorkie. Um, looking for Yorkies for adoption would be one really, really great way to do it. And the other only way that I would ever recommend getting a Yorkie from a breeder is to actually do the Yorkshire Terrier Club of America. So the Yorkshire Terrier Club of America is all going to be Yorkie show breeders. Very small list, they're very, very strict with the breeders. And the breeders are actually raising the Yorkies because they love Yorkshire Terriers so much. They are in no way looking to make a profit on their Yorkies. They've put a lot of time and a lot of money into their puppies and they're looking for a really great home. And the reason that they do it is that they're always, they're showing dogs and so they're producing that perfect show dog. So Alfie, was a show dog. He was raised and he was a show champion by a Yorkshire Terrier Club of America show breeder. He is still technically in circulation and being bred, but I was allowed to keep him and once in a great while she borrows him back and he has puppies. So I never actually disclose where, um, where I got him because I really uh, I know that the breeder doesn't want to get that attention, but I also, um, I want people to learn to do the work on their own. Um, I'm not looking to sell Yorkies. I'm looking to make sure that Yorkies get a really, really great home. Um, and so you should look for Yorkshire Terrier Club of America in your area or look for puppies for adoption. But please know that if you go on this first page, and trust me, when I was first looking for a Yorkshire Terrier, I too looked at something like this and I looked to see where there were breeders and things like that. And I finally figured out that the when I spoke to my mom who had had a Yorkie when I was a child, 
that getting one through a show breeder is actually the best way to get one. You know that the parents had humane treatment. You know that the puppies had great treatment. Um, and that is the way that you're going to get a really great dog. If you can go and you can just go pick up a dog that day, I don't think that's a good thing. Puppies are not pizzas. They should not be available for delivery and you should be spending time getting ready and when you find a good breeder, they should be asking you questions about how you're going to care for that dog. And if you find a Yorkie to adopt, they should be asking you questions so that they know that you are going to take the best care of that dog. Um, please don't buy a Yorkie off of Craigslist. It's actually very possible that that Yorkie was stolen. Um, don't buy a Yorkie that someone bred in their backyard, that they had just two very random Yorkies that perhaps were not genetically tested. Um, I know that this might not seem important to you when you're getting your dog, and they're all cute, all puppies are cute, but what you really want to do when you are buying a dog is to make sure that you're actually supporting a breeder that's going to be humane or a place that you're adopting the Yorkie from that has taken really good care of it. Um, I do think that during this time uh, where we had a lot of shutdowns and things like that, a lot of people adopted Yorkies and maybe some of them should not have. And I believe that there are going to be a lot of Yorkies that need homes. And trust me, a, an adult Yorkie, like if you look at Alfie, Alfie is every bit as cute as a baby. And I did not get him when his, he was a baby. And you will love an adult Yorkie just as much as a baby. So I just wanted you to know, really, really look out for this. So that's the search results from... Yorkie puppies for sale near me. And if you look at, um, if you look at the next one, I'm sorry, this is Yorkie puppies for sale near me. And this one is actually, there's one good one. There's this looks good. Adopt a pet. Don't look at anything that has the word teacup in it, please. Whatever you do, if it says teacup, stay away from it. Um, just really, really do your research and make sure, please make sure that you are not buying from a puppy mill. They don't treat dogs humanely. They put them in a van and they ship them around when they should not be taken away from their mothers. And um, if you're excited about getting a dog, I think that you should really care about how that dog was treated from minute one. Um, it's just such a common, common thing. Um, so anyway, please look into adopting, look into the Yorkshire Terrier Club of America. Um, I really hope that this video was helpful to you. Um, please leave a comment below and let me know if you are looking for a Yorkie. Um, and obviously I'm not going to tell you where to get a Yorkie, but I am going to tell you where not to get it from. Um, and again, look at the Yorkshire Terrier Club of America and look at adopting a Yorkie. I hope you guys stay healthy and stay beautiful and please leave Alfie and I a comment below. If you have not already subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do so. And do check out the description below. I have listed some of my absolute favorite Yorkie products of all times in the description. Thanks so much, guys. Bye. Thank you.